Hey, what's up everyone? Today I want to do a really quick video showing you how to stake your NEO to get gas. And so I really put this off for a long, long time because I had my NEO on an exchange that didn't give me any gas. And this was Bittrex because I was thinking I was going to day trade NEO, but I ended up not doing so. So I probably lost out on close to $100 worth of gas. So we all know about NEO, right? If you've probably heard about it before, this is the Chinese version of Ethereum. So it's a smart contracts platform. Now remember, smart contracts, you need to give them a little bit of gas so it runs. So in Ethereum, gas is just additional ether. But in NEO, they split it up between NEO and gas itself. They call it literally gas. And this is actually worth quite a bit of money itself, like more than half of the price of NEO. And so you should probably be staking your NEOs. And I'm going to show you how in a really, really quick and easy video. So first of all, you need a wallet to hold your NEO, or some exchanges let you get gas too, but the wallet is probably the best approach. So you go to GitHub, and I'll include this link below, but you go to the City of Zion Neon Wallet, it's called the Neon Wallet, and you download it for Linux, Mac, or Windows. And let me just open it up. So create new wallet, passphrase, um, Just gonna do some random passphrase. No, I'm not gonna have any Neo here, so you can't steal it from me. <laughs> Generating a coded key. Okay, and then now you see this screen, you must save this information. Maybe you take a screenshot or just write these down and then name it. Testing for video. Save key. Save, saved key. Okay, now back. Login using saved wallet. Now you type in your passcode again, decrypting, and voila, here you go. So here's your address, your public address. You go to your exchange like Bittrex and you withdraw to this address. Now one very important thing is that NEO is actually indivisible. That means it's, you can't have fractions here. It's just one or two or three. There's no like 1.005 or something like that. So exchanges do have fees though. So if their fee is like 0.25, for example, and you want to withdraw one, you need to put in the amount 1.25. So after they take out the 0.25, you still have one left. Because in the exchanges, they can show like decimals, but that's just all like virtual in their database. That's not the real amount you have. It's not indivisible. So let's say you want to withdraw 10, but you have like a little bit more than 10. In that case, you'd put 10.25, and then you get 10. After a while, you go back to your wallet, refresh balance, and it will show up here. At first, you're going to have zero gas, but it's going to start generating it immediately. It's going to be a very small amount. Like This is going to show like 0 0.00001 or something. And it's proportional to the amount of NEO you have. The more NEO you have, the more get gas you'll get faster. And so after a while, this will go to some bigger amount and then you can claim it and it'll show up in this balance. Now I hope that was helpful so you can put your NEO in this wallet and start getting gas and eventually you can sell gas too or use it if you want. And I'm not going to show you the rest of this because it's outside the scope of this video. If you have any questions though feel free to let me know down in the comments below. Give me a thumbs up and I'll see you next time.